Hey, while you in the first five seconds of the video, go ahead, like and subscribe. Knowing about Dan is not important. Knowing about Dan is not going to get you to where them gold gates is. That's what we be trying to tell our people. You don't have brothers come up and, oh, what's the name? What's the name? Oh, why y'all don't speak Hebrew? All this stuff that's not important. If you don't do what God says, you're not getting into them gold gates. You're not getting that everlasting life. If you are in verse 8, don't even think about verse 12. Specifically, what did it say specifically about Dan? It says something before it said that they will fall and not rise again. What did it say? I'm gonna read it again. Read. They that swear by the sin of Samaria. What was the sin of Samaria? What was the northern kingdom? Hold on, excuse me. What was the northern kingdom, which is these nine tribes, eat from on down? What was the sin of Samaria? What were they doing in Samaria? You say what? They were worshiping idols. That's the sin of Samaria. Read. They that swear by the sin of Samaria and say thy God, O Dan, live it, and the manner of Beersheba live it. Even they shall fall and never rise up again. So Dan fell as a result of that. Get 1 Kings 16. In verse 32. First Kings 16 and verse 32. This is the book of First Kings, chapter 16, and verse 32. And he reared up an altar for Baal in the house of Baal, which he had built. Baal. What is Baal? Is that the God of this Bible? He's a false god. Exactly. So Jeroboam caused the northern kingdom of Israel to go into idolatry because he was afraid of them going back to Judah and worshiping. When he went against the plan that was already told to him. You understand? So they raised up Baal the idol, read. Which he had built in Samaria. Which he built where? In Samaria. That's the sin of Samaria. It was idols all over the place. Read. And Ahab made a grove. And Ahab did more to provoke the Lord God of Israel to anger than all of the kings of Israel that were before him. In his days did Hiel the Bethlehem built Jericho. He laid the foundation thereof in Abraham, his firstborn. That's it on that. So you see the sin of Samaria. Yeah. I was just showing you. So when you go back to Amos, go back to Amos 8 and 14. Bring it out, Ock. Quick, go back to Amos 8 and 14. This is the book of Amos, chapter 8 and verse 14. Oh. They that swear by the sin of Samaria. So what's the sin of Samaria? Idolatry. And what happened? And say, thy God, O Dan, live it, and the matter of Beersheba live it. Even they shall fall and never rise up again. You see that? Those idols was built in Dan. So can I ask you something? Go ahead. So for the family, people that came through the tribe of Dan, even people now that's under the tribe of Dan, they can't repent and, um, and you know, be the covenant. Now let's deal with that. Okay. Where are those people? Genesis 33? Not Genesis 33. Deuteronomy 33. Give me uh Dan. Deuteronomy 33. Uh, 22. 22. Cause I ain't looking at it. 33, 22. This is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 30, 33, verse 22. And of Dan he said. Talking about Dan, because this is what you asked about, right? Dan is a lion's whelp. He shall leap from Bashan. 
and of Naphtali, he said, on that. Hold on. Read that again. We talking about Dan. And of Dan, he said, Dan is a lion's will. Uh -huh. He shall leap from Bashan. So Bashan was where? Where Benjamin was. So the tribe of Dan got absorbed into the tribe of Benjamin. But far as Dan being known as a tribe, that's not no more. And the Bible just showed you why. No, I understand that, but can they still repent of their sins and still get saved even though they are no... They can still repent. They're the 12 tribes. But I want you to understand, they're not listed as a tribe anymore. They got absorbed into the tribe of Benjamin. So now they under Benjamin. Okay. Read. 49, 16. Genesis 49, 16. Genesis 49, 16. Here we go. This is the book of Genesis, chapter 49 and verse 16. Then shall judge his people as one of the tribes of Israel. Uh -huh. There shall be a serpent by the way, an adder in the path, that biteth the horse hills, so that his rider shall fall backward. So that's going into a little history of Dan when they was on this side of earth. When they fought against the white man, so on and so forth, as the care of Indians. But the main thing that we need to focus on is the keeping of God's law. That's right. You understand? Go back to Revelation 21 where we read. Because the same thing that's promised to all the 12 tribes, they're not going to get that if they're not keeping God's law. Read Revelation 21 and 12. This is the book of Revelation, chapter 21, and verse 12. Yeah. And had a wall, great and high, and had 12 gates, and at the gates 12 angels, uh -huh. and names written thereon, which are the names of the 12 tribes of Israel. We know that. That's talking about the kingdom. But here's something that we always overlook when we read that. Jump up to verse 8. You're not going to get what's read here if you are in this boat here. Read that. Verse 8, but the fearful Bring it out. and unbelieving. And what? And unbelieving. If you are an unbeliever, right. you show yourself to be an unbeliever when you hear the word and you don't do what the word says. That's the actions of an unbeliever. Right. Don't we always everybody know about verse 12? The tall walls with the diamonds in them. 12 gates, angels, living forever, no more sorrow, no more pain. We read about that, but we overlook this verse right here. If you are in this boat, you will not experience that. Read. But the fearful and unbelieving and the abominable. The what? Abominable. Now, when you're an abominable thing, you're vile in the eyesight of God. Like cross-dressing. He doesn't want his sons and his daughters cross-dressing. Bring it up. What's an example of cross-dressing? Give me an example. Like men wearing dresses. And women wearing what? <laughs> and pants. <laughs> I see you, you hit the stop. You hit the pause on me. Bring it up. Bring it up. Knowing about Dan is not important. That's Knowing that's about right. Dan is not going to get you to where them yeah. gold gates is. Yeah. That's what we be trying to tell our people. You don't have brothers come up and, oh, what's the name? What's the name? Oh, why y'all don't speak Hebrew? All this stuff that's not important. If you don't do what God says, you're not getting into them gold gates. You're not getting that everlasting life. If you are in verse 8, don't even think about verse 12. Read on. Finish that eight up. But the fearful and unbelieving and the abominable and murderer. And what? And murderer. Is not thou shall not kill in the Ten Commandments. Bro. If you're a murderer, you're not getting into the kingdom of heaven. Bro. Read. And whoremongers. Whoremongers. You like to sleep around. Bro. You're not getting into the kingdom of heaven. Bro. Remember verse 8 said, these people are outside those gates. They're yes, not getting right. in. That's right. Read. And whoremongers and sorcerers. People involved in witchcraft. If you are into zodiac signs, you are a sorcerer. Yeah. People use that to try to read your spirit. That's oh, right. when is your birthday? They trying to gauge your personality. That's trying to read your spirit. That's witchcraft. That's right. You're a sorcerer. You will not get into the kingdom of heaven. Read. And idolaters. And what? 
and idolaters. Let's get some examples of idolatry. Excuse me, sir. Let's get some examples of idolatry. This is idolatry, man. Our people don't know that. Hey. Birthdays, that's idolatry. One Bring second, sir. All of those things, when we follow these other religions, that's all idolatry. Because I know you know. You know you Israel, but you got to start applying. That's right. Read. And all liars. And all what? All liars. Do not our people do that? So how, how in the world can we talk about getting to a kingdom if we are doing these things in verse 8? If we can't stop doing these things in verse 8, right. we must first stop doing these things in verse 8. Right. Right. I got to read it for you. Deuteronomy 22 and 5. Because you know it, but you got to start applying but make that always covered always got a dress on but make that the last time because you got to think a, a wise man said you may be the only bible somebody sees when i heard that i'm like man that's heavy that means you might be the only representation of the word so how would i know that you keep the commandments if i see you like that just like if you see one of us we got these on work sleep snow that's right facial hair work sleep snow because that's a commandment you know how else you teach people by doing it too your actions so you got to be an example for the young ladies out here. Right. Knowing about Dan, that's not important. That's not going to stop our young ladies from trying to be like Cardi B. Bring it up. What will stop them from trying to be like her is when they see you keeping the commandments. Nation is men leading by example.